Hi everyone, I'm Lauren from Speech Clinic. Today we'll be chatting about telepractice, a new up and coming area for speech pathology. With the introduction of the NBN network, satellite internet and the soon to be rolled out 5G network, telepractice speech pathology is becoming increasingly known among medical professionals, clinicians and families. However, telepractice is not a new concept. Research has actually been going on since the 1970s. What is telepractice? Telepractice refers to the use of telecommunications technology, so computer networks or the internet, to provide clinical services from afar. Using telepractice, a speech pathologist can undertake assessments and provide intervention to a child or their parents or caregivers. Speech Clinic can deliver speech pathology services to children living anywhere within Australia that have internet access. Telepractice can also be referred to as telehealth, telerehabilitation, online speech therapy, or remote speech therapy. We have experience using telepractice to provide both individual and group sessions. So what does telepractice speech pathology actually look like? In a telehealth appointment, your speech pathologist will send a connecting link to your nominated email address. By simply clicking on this link, either on your computer, laptop or tablet, you and your child will be able to access your appointment. Telehealth appointments occur in real time, so this means that you will then be able to see, hear and talk with your speech pathologist just as you would be able to do in a face-to-face -face consultation. During your speech pathology appointment, your therapist will provide intervention. If your child is school-aged, Therapy appointments may involve sharing picture books, reading texts, drawing pictures and figures, or writing. All of these traditional therapy activities are possible using telehealth. If though you are seeking telehealth appointments for a younger child, perhaps for stuttering, or if they are a late talker, telehealth sessions will focus upon parental education and also consultation, much like they would in a face-to-face -face consultation. How will I know if telepractice is right for my child? We will work closely with you to understand your child's needs and to determine if the required intervention approaches can be used or if necessary adapted during telehealth appointments. As we work together, we may need to consider your child's physical and sensory needs, their cognitive abilities, particularly their attention, also the significance or the severity of their communication needs, cultural and linguistic diversity of your family, and also the availability of a parent or a caregiver to attend and where needed help facilitate a telehealth appointment. Like all speech pathology intervention, time needs to be taken to determine if telehealth is the best option for you and your child. Positively, telehealth services can provide great benefit to families living in rural or remote communities, or families that have difficulty accessing traditional therapy due to individual differences. However, telehealth may not be the best option for your child or your family if you are struggling with technology requirements, internet connectivity, or again, based upon the individual differences and the particular needs that your child has. What does the evidence say about telehealth for children and adolescents? Increasing amounts of research are currently being undertaken in the area of telepractice paediatric speech pathology. To date, research has focused upon the role of telehealth to both assess and provide intervention for childhood speech sound disorders, language disorders and also for stuttering. Excitingly, recent research has also shown positive outcomes for adolescents presenting with traumatic brain injuries and also for the education and consultation services of parents with children on the autism spectrum. Some intervention approaches offered by Speech Clinic, such as Lidcom or the Camperdown program, have already undertaken their specific clinical trials within telehealth. For other clinical areas that have not yet had specific telehealth trials, telepractice services are based upon the best current face-to-face -face evidence and offered with the same level of access and frequency as this intervention type. To learn more about telehealth and to help understand if this option is right for your child, contact us via our website at speechclinic.com.au.